Hello. So, I made a video back, like, uh, a few years ago, I think, at this point. It's a really old video. I'll show a photo on the screen of the video. Um, but it was pretty much just me using Cheat Engine in, uh, American Truck Simulator, which is uh, pretty simple. Like, it's one of the most simple things you can do. Um, so I, in that last, in that last video, I... Uh, glitch the money and I glitched the XP. So that's what we're gonna be showing. That's what I'm gonna be showing you right now in this video. Um, this is a revised version for the new version of Sheet Engine. Um, and it's just a revised version in itself. So we're just gonna create a new profile. We're gonna name it. Um, uh, um, we're gonna name it. And then the picture, hmm. yeah, <laughs> um, let's see, what truck, let's go with a western star, um, company logo, uh, the eagle, company name, okay, let's start the game, oh, keyboard, simple automatic, finish for through. I was using uh, my wheel last time I played the game. So once you load in, oh, yep. Yeah, once you load here, you will it'll ask you what headquarters you want. So we're gonna start out in let's just do Las Vegas. It does not matter what you start out in. I'm uh, gonna say no to tutorial. Wait for it to load. By the way, if you haven't done this already, once you load in, I want you to go to options, go to graphics or video, and then um. I don't know if you can hear my dogs barking, but um, go to video and then change it to, and check the box that says full screen, and turn that off because we want to easily be able to access Cheat Engine. Okay, so once you log or once you get in, you are going to be in this truck. So then you should um, follow the map that you see in the bottom right hand corner, and you're going to want to follow it, so we're going to take our nice right out of here. I'm using a keyboard and mouse because I'm too lazy to set up my wheel. And you're just, you're just going to follow this line right here. Uh, this part right here is just something you have to do. Um, it's pretty sad, I know. Um, yeah, so we'll just go ahead and finish your job real quick. Okay, so then once you've pulled into... Or once you pulled in front of the uh, Walbert here, um, you're going to want to take... Uh, left into the actual Walbert, and then stop at this little green box right here. And then we'll just do skip for now because we're in a hurry. Okay, excellent. Sure, fine. It doesn't matter what you got. Um, continue. Then once you load in, let's see. There we go. You get your headquarters. You can just go ahead and skip it. Yeah. Okay. So right here is the truck that you selected, doesn't matter. Could be Western Star, could be literally anything you want. Anyways, let's get into the actual cheat now. So, you're gonna see right here, under uh, your name, <laughs> um, the name of your company, you're gonna see the money, which, you know, in my case, is uh, 1868. So we're gonna go ahead and Alt-Tab to Cheat Engine. Uh, which you should have open. Um, if you don't have, the, have this installed, I will leave a link in the description and there will be a link on the screen. It's a very simple um, website name. I'm pretty sure it's just cheatengine.org, I think. Like, it's just the name.org. It's very simple, so you should just be able to type it in. But um, I'll have the link in the description. Uh, it's a very simple download. It's an exe file, so then once you download it, you go to your downloads folder, wherever it's saved, and then you run it, and then it installs. It's just like any other program. Then you're gonna, once you got it open, you're gonna head, you're gonna want to go ahead and hit the little computer icon in the top left, and then you're gonna see the process list. This is all your process, this is all the applications that you have running right now. So then... Um, if you wanna, if you don't see your game here, it's gonna be in the processes tab, and then you have to scroll through this whole entire thing to see all your processes. So we're gonna go back to applications, and then you're gonna see American Truck Simulator. So you're gonna wanna go ahead and select that, hit open. If it goes like this, just click inside the thing and then move your wheel around or move your mouse around. So then Alt Tab out, 
and then we will put in the amount of money we have, which in my case is 1868 Do not put the commas in there, just put in the number itself. So once you have the number hit uh, first scan, then it's going to come up with, with all, these, all these numbers here. You're just going to want to ignore that, and then come back to your game right here, and uh, go to job market, quick job, and sort, I think this is, oh, you're going to want to sort route length by, uh, by the up arrow, uh, and then choose the one that is the least distance, you want the least amount of distance. So then you're going to take that job, and then once it loads, you are going to you can see on the map, it's literally the exact same thing that I did like five seconds ago. This it probably will not be the same thing that you just did, but it might be. Um, so anyways, you're just going to go ahead and complete the job. And we are now just about finished with our job right here. So we're just going to go ahead and pull her in. Oof, it's close. Go ahead and pull her in right here. And then go to the green air, green truck thing trailer then stop on it and then uh, hit enter and then we're gonna do skip right now because we're not doing the xp we're doing the money itself right now so then you're gonna see the screen show results now continue uh so then on the right you'll see that your money has increased two two three four in my case so i'm gonna go back to alt tab back to cheat engine and then i'm gonna go to the value section and then change it to two two three four and then instead of hitting new scan, I'm going to hit next scan. Then there's going to be a certain amount of processes for your your computer specifically. In my case, it's just one. So then you're going to go ahead and click it. And then do alt or not alt. You're going to do control A, which selects all of them in the thing. In my case, it's just one again. Uh, but in some cases, it might not be one. It might be two or three or five or 20. I don't care. It doesn't matter. Um, so you're going to go ahead and select them all. And then hit this little red arrow here then you're gonna click this uh you're gonna click the first one and then control a again and then right click change record value then uh, uh you can literally change it to whatever you want i just usually add a bunch of zeros and then hit enter then sure and look at this Oop. and then you go back to your game right uh go to your map Exit your map, you'll see your money right here. Works every time, works like a charm. So now we're going to do it for the, uh, what's it called? The uh, XP. So right now we can we have four XP. You can see in the top right um, underneath our truck icon. So we're going to hit new scan at the top and then we're gonna hit the uh, red X uh, on the bottom. Uh, do you want to le delete all addresses? Select yes. Okay, and then where it says value, enter your amount of XP. In my case, it is four. So I'm going to hit four and then first scan. This is probably going to be a bunch of processes, a bunch of values. Uh, I've probably said processes a bunch of times, but just values. So once you've uh, done the first scan, you're going to want to go ahead and go back to your game, job market, quick job. And then you're going to want to do the same thing, a very quick job, like this, take job. And then once it loads, you're just going to want to drive to the destination like normal. So, uh, yes, Ooh, look at, mm -hmm. very cool, nice truck. So anyways, you're going to want to go all the way, all right, I stopped, you're going to want to go all the way to your destination. But don't, um, don't pick the skip. Pick the, uh, pick this, uh, second hardest one. Because we want the XP. I went the wrong way. But we want the XP. So choose the one that gives you more XP, like 15 or 40. It's gonna be a little bit harder to park. That's a lot of damage! Get out of my fucking way. I'm driving here. Fucking dumbass. I can't talk while driving. So, yeah, once you get there, choose the 15 or 40 XP. Um, I will show you in just a minute. So then, once you get over here to your uh, destination, wherever that may be, uh, 
you are going to pull in. Since we have infinite money, it doesn't matter if you blow any red lights. Just $150 out of the $61.6 .6 million. Doesn't matter. Anyways, so once you get to your destination, you're gonna pull in here. Let's just pull in. Yeah, just like that. And then you're gonna wanna stop and then hit enter. And then you're gonna wanna either do where do you need it or play it safe. I'm just gonna play it safe right now because that's the easier one. So then you're gonna wanna drive. This part is a little bit challenging for uh, some people. Uh, but you're gonna have to pretty much do this for it to work. So pretty much just park. Do it. Do what it says. Uh, park in the uh, box, the outline box. Uh, I've played a lot of America Truck Simulator in my time. Uh, most of it's on a wheel. Not a lot has been on keyboard. So we're gonna see how this goes. There we go. That's 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 pretty good. Let's pull a little more. There you go. That's that's pretty good. There we go. Perfect. So you're gonna get all this stuff. Uh, you're gonna see all the experience you gain. So you gave 29 experience. Now you have 33. That's exactly what we need. So you're gonna see in the top right corner, like you've seen before, you're gonna see 33 XP. So now you're gonna want to go back to Cheat Engine, Alt Tab, and then you're gonna want to type in 33, because that is your new XP value. So then after you type in 33, you're gonna hit Next Scan. You're gonna see uh, a few addresses here. You're gonna want to sele select one and then Control A like before. Hit the down arrow, click one, Control A like before. Right click, change record value. And then you can change it to whatever you want. I usually just add zeros because it's the simplest and then just hit okay. Now, if this happens, it's okay. Don't worry. You've typed in too many zeros. Then you can just do undo last edit. Then everything goes back to, to normal. Then you can change record value. Try it again. Let's add a bunch of zeros like that. Boom. Now it's worked. So maybe, the, maybe I typed in a little bit too much the first time. So then you're going to want to go ahead and update it. So hit map or M for map and then exit. And you will see, yeah, you got a bunch of XP. So that is pretty much how you use Cheat Engine and exp or not explain. What the fuck am I talking about? That's pretty much how you use Cheat Engine and American Truck Simulator. It's very simple. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty fun. Uh, now you have like infinite money and infinite XP. So have fun, guys.